this week in Cape Town, South Africa. Hi guys, my name is Chris. I'm an online ESL teacher from Cebu, but now I live in one of the world's most beautiful cities, Cape Town, South Africa. Cape Town has maintained its rank as one of the best cities in the world, and today I will show you a few reasons why. So let's jump into it. First, we'll take you to Boulder's Beach. In a little less than an hour drive from the city, in a suburb called Simonstown, is a popular tourist spot because of a colony of African penguins which settled there in 1982. Today is a hot summer day with a pleasant 22 degrees. Summer here is from December to March and the coldest months here is on June to September. I've traveled to over 80 countries around the world and I'm so excited to see these penguins in Chile and Antarctica. Now I feel so blessed to be living in a city where I can see them any day I want. Our next stop is at Musenberg, a beachside town in the Western Cape and it's considered to be the main surfing spot in Cape Town. On a normal summer day, this beach is packed, but due to the restrictions of lockdown level 3 here, it's also amazing not to see a single soul. Now let's head to Signal Hill to view the iconic Table Mountain. Driving through these historical and quaint houses painted with the bright colors, this area is called Bocap, also a popular spot for Instagrammers. Look at that absolutely stunning view of Table Mountain, one of the wonders of the world right at the heart of the city. Some days the mountain is covered with low clouds and they call it the tablecloth. Some people hike to the top but you can also take the cable car. The view from the top is just phenomenal. We'll now take you to v &A Waterfront. This is one of the most visited area with more than 24 million visitors annually. It's in the oldest working harbor in South Africa, with Table Mountain as its backdrop, amazing shops and restaurants, the famous Cape Wheel, and the beautiful Two Oceans Aquarium. Makes it a favorite for local and international visitors. What we showed you today is just a small fraction of what Cape Town has to offer. You'll need at least a week to explore its natural beauty, enjoy the amazing food, the coffee, the famous rooibos tea, and dynamic culture, and so on. I can talk for days about how beautiful Cape Town is. I'm just so blessed to call this my home. This is Chris Cousin for this week and Illustrato. For more Cape Town videos, please follow me on YouTube.